Hey you guys, Cleopatra here. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we're actually gonna be eating Rubio's Coastal Grill. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of Rubio's. It's news to my ears. I've never had it. I've never heard of it. So we're gonna go over the spread. I miss you guys. I know it's been two weeks. I know a lot of you have been asking where I've been. Um, I actually went to Boston this weekend, so I got chips. I got a burrito and I also got a kid's meal because I'm so hungry. So it's a salmon burrito, you guys. Salmon. Um, this place looks really good. There's a lot of burrito joints around me, which I'm super stoked about. Because, like, who doesn't love a good burrito, you know? Um, I got a kid's cheese quesadilla. We got, um, what is this? Like, the refried beans, I think, with, like, rice. And then I got some guacamole and i also have oh no this is the rice i think there's cheese on the beans yay which is super awesome and i also have some salsa let's do like a little thumbnail you guys wait let's get this bag out of here you guys <laughs> all right let's get to eating i'm so hungry um yeah i actually have to go pick up my boyfriend <laughs> Wait, did I just tell you guys the secret? So yeah, like I have a boyfriend now. Me. Me, you guys. And it's actually my best friend. So like, um, you know, I don't know if I talked about like my friend, Zach, but um, I moved out here um, with him. And yeah, we're like together now. Let's try this out really quick, you guys. Oh, I'm not gonna lie. The salsa is kind of like marinara sauce. Ew. Kind of reminds me of marinara sauce. I don't know how I feel about it. But yeah, like you guys, I've just been in La La Land. Um, last weekend, I think I just like felt ugly. That's why I didn't film. But the week before that, like we had just gotten together. It's just such a long story. <laughs> like, I've literally known this kid since I was 14. Um, we actually went out back in the day. It just, like, didn't work out. And, you know, that's just, like, my best friend. And we've been through so much together. We actually lost um, our really close friend to us a couple years ago to substance abuse. Um, and once again, I know it's, like, a trigger warning or whatever you want to call it. But, I mean, it's the sad reality. Oh, no, my bracelet just broke, you guys. Look at it. Whatever. But, yeah, honestly, I know this is a serious topic, so let me just speak upon it really quick. Oh, this rice is going to get all over the place. I just know it is. I don't know if I like it. It's kind of like, it's kind of like cilantro-y. I don't know, you guys. I don't know about that lettuce. I mean, the rice. So yeah, this is like a touchy subject and it sucks, but it's the harsh reality. And, you know, we kind of just had each other's backs. Well, I don't want to say like these past couple of years because we always had each other's backs, but like, you know, we're just like so close now and I You guys, like I literally just developed feelings for him overnight. Like, not like recently, like, you know, over like two years ago, maybe. Like, I don't know. Like, I just slowly started, like, really, like, liking this kid. In a different way, you know? And I'm just happy, you guys. I haven't been this happy in a long time. It's kind of scaring me. Because, <laughs> yeah, I just, like, never shared that with you guys. Um, but I figured it's the right time to tell you guys now. So, you guys, I got... What did I even get? I got a bunch of stuff. Pib. Do you guys know what Pib is? Pib, Diet Pepsi, 
I got Pib Dad Pepsi, Coca Cola Vanilla. It was like a mixture of like stuff in the uh, in the little dispenser. So this is what the quesadilla looks like. She's thicky. Mmm. 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 -hmm. Wow. Yeah, I got a lot of food. <laughs> I'm probably gonna have a nice snack for later. So this is the wild Alaskan salmon, wild Alaskan salmon burrito. Mmm. It's all pink. You guys. Wow. It's weird too because like. Over on the West Coast, you guys have a lot of places that are just like Chipotle. And like Cordoba. <sighs> but yeah. I just wanted to explain to you guys why I have been MIA. Your girl is in a relationship. I'm all booed up. But yeah, we just do like cute stuff on the weekends too. Like, we go to like San Francisco. We're really enjoying our lives in Cali right now. But like, honestly, you guys, between you and I, like, there's a lot of beef going on with my job right now. <laughs> Like, literally, I swear, like, our manager wants to fire everybody. But, like, I say manager, and he is our manager, but, like, we know him. It's, like, so, it's, like, so sticky. Oh, my goodness. Ew. You see, I knew that was going to happen. Who gives somebody a fork? With that little tiny cup. Like, it's going to spill everywhere. You guys, I'm putting my car on. I'm dying. <laughs> no, it looked like there was a lot of people outside that were staring at me, but I don't care. They can stare all they want. I'm dying. <laughs> all right, let me fold this up, and I'm going to dip it in this. I really wanted to get some queso, but they didn't have any. Look how green that is. Uh, I'm coming back strong. <laughs> But yeah, I really miss you guys. I hope you're doing really good. Honestly, taking a break, like taking a week back though, like a couple weeks back, stepping down, whatever you want to call it. Um, no, it's just nice to see that you guys like miss me and stuff. Cause I don't, I felt bad. Like I just been in like la la land and then I'm like, oh my God, you know, priorities. It's not like I'm slacking. I'm just... You guys know how it is. You guys get it. It's just refreshing, honestly. And back to like the whole like, you know, it's gonna be like that two month mark of me coming out here. And like, I don't wanna say it's the best decision I've ever made just yet, but I think like in a couple of months or years, then I can say this was the, biggest life-changing decision of my life or something like that like this probably will be that in the future and not even like this just being like being like successful with my friends like I know we'll be fine but between you and I, like, dude, you guys, one of my friends got, like, literally fired. But she's kind of crazy, because, like, she'll be acting like, 
she's out working and stuff. But, you know, she kind of, like, she kind of kind of fabricates everything. And I'm not trying to be rude. I'm just saying, like, um, like, own up to your... <coughs> Wrong tube. Own up to, like, like, be accountable. Like, you know, if you're really not working that much, just say that. And, you know, she had, like, a heart-to-heart. -heart. Yo, this salsa's gross. I'm not gonna lie. So far, the food is awesome. It's just this salsa is, like, not cutting it for me, you guys. It's so annoying being a lefty because I keep putting, like, my armpit in the camera. <laughs> but, anywho... I'm gonna just tell you guys straight up the tea. Like, she gets fired, right? But my manager kind of forced it. Like, he took it to the next extreme. And, like, he literally fired her. He took her out of, like, the group chat. And he told her straight up, you're done. Her account is terminated. She got me, like, did you tell him about, like, my second job? And I'm like, no, why would I tell him that? Like, friendly manager or not, I'm not talking to my management about your whereabouts. But she was just freaking out because he fired her. And she kind of told him, like, dude, I quit that other job for this, like, You know, she finally told him straight up. The other day, they had, like, a heart-to-heart. -heart and straight up was like, this is what I want. I'm going to work really hard. He totally agreed. And now look what's happening. Like, I think he's just trying to scare her to the point of no return. Or, like, scared, like, shitless. Like, because... Now she has to make it work. She can still work under like our friends. It's confusing. She can still work, but he's trying to literally scare her into making it work. Will she do it? I don't know. I don't know. It's like the boy who cried wolf. Like you just know how somebody is. And, like, you know, some people do make excuses. There's a difference between if you went out and, like, worked every day or whatever. And, like, you didn't get anything. Like, that sucks. But if you're not working at all, like, be honest and say that you weren't. Because he's really trying to help her out. Hella drama. I'm honestly in a good mood though like I know you guys I kept venting to you guys about everything and I'm scared or whatever like at this point I'm like at this point I'm super happy <laughs> I'm like whatever but I really can't have any other attitude towards it like I'm doing good I'm putting in the work I just came from work actually you guys I gotta go pick up my boyfriend it's so weird saying that <laughs> I'm really full though. This place was really good. This Rubio's fire. Let me know if you guys have a Rubio's near you. But I'm going to wrap it up here. I'm so happy to be back. I'll be back um, next Friday as well. I like forgot what day I do mukbangs. Like, hello. But yeah. Hope you guys like this video. If you did, please give me a like, comment, and subscribe on the bottom. Let me know if you guys want me to do like a QA, and a Ask me questions. If you want me to film with my boyfriend already. Like, you want to see... <clears throat> The grand reveal of my mans like let me know yeah i'm gonna go now you guys i gotta go pick up my mans have a good night bye